Hello everyone, I'm Fountainhead and you're watching me probably die, maybe succeed, but probably die on Bloodborne. So, cool. Is it? No. Oh, don't be foul, there's a beast in here, and that's fine. So, we're gonna just pop. some of these kin bloods just to help us gain maybe another level we've got three okay so let's go to 50 arcane and then 15 strength 31 vigor at the end of the day, the thing that's holding us back the most is our HP. Our HP is atrociously bad. Um, so now we've done Dark Beast Pal. No, we're not going to do Kane House just yet. I've said I won't, so I won't. So shall we just do the really cheap tactic of skipping all through? this next area. I've still got my chicken salad and it's so good. The way to cheat this is pop. Oh, hello, friend. Cool. So, this area is kind of hidden. I should have upgraded my weapon, but well. Oh, hello, friend. Yeah, we really should have upgraded our weapon. So this place gives us access to this area. Cool. Gives you access to, to this area where there's, you know, a good amount of bloodstone chunks. Um, but also, there's this little portal. Ta-da! Oh. Gives us access to here. And where's here, you might ask? <laughs> um... So you can go this way and be attacked by one of those, which we'll do. Because why not? So now we're restocked on Blood Files. Um, we're going to explore this place after. Because um, the place we need to go is the other side. It's this way. Now, what this is will, will, will do is it gives us access to the, to the boss a lot quicker. So we're gonna really cheat the boss. <laughs> so the boss fight is down there. Oh, there's bullets there. Let's get those bullets. Now, this boss has a lot of HP, and it's so important, it has its own cutscene. So we're going to give it a mighty gold go. And then we can backtrack from this, from this boss fight, we can backtrack if, if necessary to explore this area. 
But let's just enjoy the cutscene, shall we? This is me in the morning before I do my skincare regime. I also fall out of the sky. <laughs> so, the first time I ever fought the one reborn, I fought it with someone I was co oping with. Didn't know who it was, just called the bell. They killed him on one hit. So I was like, oh, the one reborn's really easy. No, not. <laughs> it's not an easy boss, but it's not really a difficult boss. It's, it's, it's maybe like a, a 7 out of 10. No, no. I'd say maybe a 6 out of 10 for difficulty. It's not exceedingly difficult. I would say Bloodstar Beast is a bit more tricky if you don't know how to cheese it. It's creepy. I'll give you that. So if you don't kill these things, they just shoot balls at you. And although I love balls being shot at me, it's not really what I'm looking for in a, in, in a man, you know? I don't want him to throw his balls at me. I want him to throw me his life savings. Yeah, that's what all I'm looking for. I'm not looking for a lot, I'm just looking for a man who feeds me and uh, does all the household chores and pays for everything. Again, not a lot. You dropped something though, didn't you? You did. Bullets, okay. Not useful. <laughs> right, so now. Yeah. Oh. 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 Not good. Not good. So just gonna heal. Heal again. Run! See, he just doesn't do a lot. Our physical attacks do a lot more. And when I mean physical, I mean my magical attacks do a lot more. Heal would be nice. Should we see what this does? How much this does? Not a lot. Okay, good to know. Oh, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get killed. I'm gonna get killed on it. Yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? I don't know. We're just gonna do some stuff to this boss. And dodge back, because when it does... I feel like bosses punish you if you knock them down. So if you do knock them down, you've just kind of got to like run afterwards. Oh no, it's fire, it's fire, it's, it's not fire, it's, it's poison. Goop! Lovely, lovely goop. Oh, 
No, 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 no. That did nothing. Nothing to you. There we go. He is now unborn. He is now unborn. Ah, oh, finally got a backbone. Right, so, um... We have quite a lot of souls. So, we're gonna... Backtrack. We've now killed the boss in this area, so we can't summon anyone. But I'm trying not to summon anyone anyway. Unless I really need it. Yeah, so this area isn't really pleasant, but the boss isn't too bad. As long as you kill those things, like those those bell ringers, you're fine. I'm actually really shocked that I managed to do that fight. On my own. On my own! Right. So we're just going to heal up from that, because that was nasty. I've died to that boss quite a few times in my life. Um... But it's 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 it isn't it is it's not a difficult fight. It's just he has a lot of HP. So this is where you would have come if you went in the bath and came down the other way. So let's go in here. Let's see what's in here. Are you dropping the thing? No, you won't. Oh, hi, friend. I love that spell. It's so much fun. It's just so, it can be so broken. Oh. This is where it brings us. This is where it brings us. Proper words, please. Proper words. Cool. Right, so. Let's, let's, let's carry on going backwards. See what we missed. So, that nun who is at the bottom of that place, if you dress up in church gear and talk to her, she is very... You can convince her to go to Erden Chapel, and then she's very jealous of the prostitute. Oh, so we've not really missed anything. Okay. We've missed this, but... We've done this bit before, because that goes the steps going towards the thing. Right, yeah, we've not really missed anything. Quick swim back is probably this way. No, it's not. I I always forget how small this, like, I consider Yahagul to be three parts. The first part being... Um, that first initial bit with the first Amygdala. Um, going all the way down to the just past, just 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 before the second amygdala, and then I see the second part being like where he shoots the laser gun to going to the, the this that that where we originally would have come if we jail Hippodonian jail. I'm really not explaining it, and I see the third part being from that one where the three hunters were all the way up to the boss, and I'm like, I forget how small the third section is. 
I know that I've made literally no sense, and that's fine. I don't mind. <laughs> Say, this looks familiar. I wonder where we are. Say, this looks really familiar. Maybe like a hall of lecturing? Or a building where many halls are for lecturing. I wonder where we are. Um... Oh, nothing fell. I just rolled and freaked myself out. Cool. Did you hear it? Did you hear it fall? I sure did. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, boy. Not going to associate with you for a minute, but coming to you because you're fun, you're flirting, you're my ideal match on OK Cupid. Oh. I don't know why, but I consider bloodstone chunks to be like thrombuses. That did like nothing to you. He comes back. How did how did he not hit? I mean, I'll take it, but I don't quite understand logic. So I saw a uh, an article just yesterday that said that a lot of people don't like blood vials and they think like it's they prefer the estus. Now I will agree with people that blood vials are a very unique thing but apparently like they're much inferior and I'm like I like the idea of them being infinite but finite and when you're going through the place you don't have to keep going back because you've run out of Estus like Dark Souls 2 had life gems so if you did run out of Estus you at least had life gems to get you by until like you know you were you, you, you were home and dry but I like the blood vial system. I might be the only one that likes it, but if we list up pro, 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 pros and cons, oh, oh, teeth in. If we list up pros and cons, let's do, let's let's dissect it. Okay. So a pro of the blood vial is it's infinite because there is an infinite many, but you've got to grind for them or buy them. The pro is that they're infinite, the con is how you, how you gain them. The pro is that they drop quite freely and readily, which they do. You'd be a fool to think they don't, because they do. Um, but the con is again, Oh, they're really difficult to, 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 to get so many of them uh, because they don't drop as freely as they should do but it's just enough where you don't feel like you're that was that was <laughs> patches the spider Oh, it didn't give me the rune. Okay. 
There's a rune he drops for HP. Um, and there's probably a way I can get it, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yes, yeah, so... Um, they, they do drop infinitely, but they really are difficult to get. The Estus Flask, you get a certain amount. But when you've drunk them all, you've got to go back to the bonfire and start again. And I just, I just think that I would like, like in Dark Souls 2, they had another method to healing. So you don't have to rely on the blood vial. Is it significantly worse? Yes. So much so that you prefer to drink Estus, but it allows you to save it for a, a reasonable thing. I don't know. I'm muttering on on. I just killed uh, Patches the spider. I should talk to him first. Because I get a rune for more HP, but it's fine. I was a fuel. So we are now approaching end game. So I'm going to light this and we're going to go and restock and level up because we've got 105,000. Oh, I went to the gym yesterday and now my arms are all sore because I'm a fool. I'm a fool. Oh, absolute fool. Also, I've just misplaced my phone and my phone's got a timer on it. Okay. Right. We'll level up. We'll level up. <laughs> so, for every two I'm putting on Arcane, I'm putting one on HP or another stat. So, strength, uh, eventually we're going on skill. But strength, strength and HP are two very important ones. I could do Chalice Dungeons now as well. Maybe. We'll fortify Tonitrus. We'll fortify Tonitrus. Blood Rock. Okay. Tonitrus is, on average, a lot better. And it's going to be really useful for when we fight the thing. Um, but anyway, I'm going to say that my name is in one. What? <laughs> <gasps> My name has been that one. If you enjoyed, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, guys.